It's 4.26 a.m. So, my shoes didn't get soaked, but they got wet. So, um, so it's like I have to leave early, get up early on my off day and freaking go somewhere else. This is not fair. Uh, and, and then being homeless, I can't rest or sleep anywhere, you know, during the day. So, I mean, I'm really bothered. Yeah, I just, well, I mean, I'm, I'm doing this pretty scenery for me, you know. So... I really hate this nightmare that I'm forced to go through. And I keep, yes, I keep talking, you know, cause if talking, help, talking it out helps me feel better, I'm gonna keep talking, you know? So um, they're making it like as if I deserve quote unquote punishment for exposing the perps. That I deserve to be punished for exposing them. And, and they want to consider that telling all my business or talking too much. You know, and, and it's like, they're making me feel like as if I'm not human. My, bio, my retarded, incestuous, sick, lesbian, biological sister Ramona told me in 2015, you wonder I mean, she tried to lie and say, oh, I'm not, that she was the only one who, tr in the family, who treat me halfway like I'm human. <clears throat> you know, so, <clears throat> I don't need any incestuous sick dykes to freaking treat me any damn way. You know, that's why I'm out of state, away from y'all sick asses. You know, <clears throat> so, I don't get away with nothing. <clears throat> but, all the abuse happening to me and you know nobody wants to take action i'm freaking sick and tired of being tormented and abused and tortured so i mean if sean the biological brother sean is supposed to be a targeted individual but then they try to put stuff in his head and brainwash him to hate my guts and want my blood, you, you know, when I say want my blood, meaning like want me dead, you know, be willing to kill me at all costs. Like one time Sean got mad at me cause he wanted to eat Chinese food from off the floor in the car when I rented a car one while years ago. And then he, no, it was a different incident. He, he got mad at me and, um, like a vicious pit bull or something, and then threatened, and, you know, and threatened me, and then said, "I fight the kill." So, and I remember my twin sister said, "Oh, Sean fights to kill." <clears throat> so, um, Sean has never killed anybody, but you know, they try to make it like me and him are pretty much uncontrollably they try to make for years all like almost all of our lives they make it like as if me and sean are the only two family members that we are uncontrollably and dangerously crazy <clears throat> and even the biological family they pretty much put a put a wedge and a st i don't want to say wedge but they put a stop you know between i mean they deliberately and on purpose blocked me and sean from attempting to get close with each other. You know, and the same thing is they treat Sean like a punished child. And, um, you know, it's but like Sean figured that he has nothing to lose and he figured he could stand up to me when we have altercations, but he's defenseless and scared against other family members. And my twin sister do the same thing. Think she's all tough shit with me, but back down and defenseless and scared with other family members. You know, so, um, I, I'm just can't rest right now. And, you know, everybody trying to 
you know, shut me down. And other professed targets don't care about what I'm going through because I'm not one of the popular fakes. And before I go, I wanted to say four days after me and my twin sister's birthday, August 29th is so-called year every year. I thought, well, how they have July 31st and August 29th, the National TI Day? Well, I call it the National Fake TI Perp Cult Day. And they have all those fake-ass rallies. I never been to them, but, you know, I feel like if the if everybody has me blocked, you know, I would hate for something bad to happen to me. If I'm blocked on all social media by these so-called targeted individuals, the popular fakes, I'm, I, I'm afraid of how they would treat me at these rallies. <clears throat> you know, so... I mean, and I would, I mean, I would be damned that there'd be two faces, like all smiling in my face and fake nice in person, but you got me blocked on social media. But everybody say we TIs need to stick together. We need to connect. And it's like, how and everybody's blocking everybody. Everybody, it's so much just sowing discord and causing division you know, only the popular fakes, only they are allowed to have a voice. Just like popular fake narcissistic abusers in those narcissistic abuse victim groups, you know, only they are allowed to have a voice in a twisted, distorted version of the truth. And real narcissistic abuse sufferers, you know, we are silence. Just like tar real target individuals are silenced and not allowed to have a voice. And then people think you're fake and fuck with you and torment and torture you who claim to be targeted individuals. And then they want to show um, fake sympathy, you, you know, once you're, after you're already dead. And then they'll be like, oh, well, Candy was a targeted, I mean, Candy was a, a true targeted individual. They might, they might make it like I'm the biggest warriors out there and stuff. Well, why was nobody listening to me when I was alive? Now I'm dead and now you want to take me seriously? All y'all fake. All y'all fake.